US secretly deployed CHAMP microwave missiles to counter Iran. The US has secretly deployed CHAMP, which stands for the Counter Electronics High Power Microwave Advanced Missile Project, microwave missiles to counter Iran. But where exactly these weapons are deployed is not reported. American journalist Ronald Kessler writes about this in his article for the British newspaper The Daily Mail. British media clarifies that CHAMP microwave missiles are capable of destroying any electronics, including electronic equipment of Iranian nuclear facilities. It is exposed to microwaves, which the author claims are harmless to people. Kessler states that the application of these weapons will be able to disable many of Iran's strategic facilities, including nuclear ones. In this case, casualties can be completely avoided. The Americans began deploying such missiles in various parts of the planet in 2019. The microwave equipment used to defeat electronics is built into air-launched cruise missiles and carried to the launch site by B-52 strategic bombers. CHAMP's range exceeds 1,100 kilometers. Such missiles are capable of flying into enemy airspace at low altitude and frying computer chips, rendering any electronic devices useless without causing collateral damage. The microwave pulse causes a sharp surge in voltage which damages the equipment before the protection can operate. It is extremely difficult to detect and destroy such a missile since along the way it disables enemy radars. The author claims it does not even have the opportunity to understand why his electronics suddenly stopped working. Once in enemy airspace, the missile stays low and emits pulses of high-power microwave energy aimed at specific targets to disable critical electronic equipment. Impressively though, it manages to fry the electronics without causing the damage that an explosion might. It is unclear where the US is fielding this weapon or who it might have shared the technology with. War in Ukraine spreads to territory of Russia on a larger scale, Kremlin's difficulties increase. Ukraine's strikes on Russian military infrastructure, oil refining and exports, as well as increased pressure on Russia's air defense system, have demonstrated that Ukraine can counter Russia with a small number of weapons, mostly domestically produced. The Institute for the Study of War, ISW, said this. ISW analysts believe that Ukrainian strikes on targets in Russia are part of a Ukrainian campaign to degrade industries that support Russian military efforts and military capabilities deployed deep in the Russian territory. Kirill Budanov, the chief of Ukraine's defense intelligence, said on the 17th of April that Ukraine planned to counter future Russian offensives by continuing to strike Russian military targets on the aggressor country's territory. In an interview with the Washington Post, Budunov said that the Ukraine's defense intelligence plans to strike a Russian defense industrial base and critical military facilities such as airfields and command and control centers in response to a projected Russian offensive in the summer of 2024. Budunov stated that the strikes are intended to show that Russian leader Vladimir Putin cannot protect the Russian population from war. In recent weeks, Russia has unleashed a barrage of exploding drones and missiles on Ukraine's energy infrastructure, leaving millions without power and raising fears that the attacks could bring Ukraine's economy to a halt. The attacks destroyed a power plant in the Kyiv region and damaged Ukraine's biggest hydroelectric power plant and multiple thermal power plants. 
The Russian Defense Ministry said the attacks were in direct response to Ukraine's drone strikes on refineries and other infrastructure deep within its territory. Now, Ukrainian officials desperately need to protect their cities, causing further strain over air defense resources between Kyiv and the West.